All right, there we go. We got it going. Give me some of that beautiful DOS music. Gonna turn that down. If you haven't seen the intro before, I'll let you guys all watch it. It's got voice acting. Nineteen ninety three. With my a pops. Fog does rise to cloud my mind to hide the prize I seek to find. Oh, ancient orb, where rest you now? My lady, I have answered your summons. <laughs> my lady. To... Yes, I see it. A place of traps to crack brave bones. There Ooh. lies the orb. Far, far away. Urgh. Oh, so many frames of animation. An ancient dungeon, and within it lies the orb. It's a strong magic that can point to maps. Now, what will you be paying <laughs> me to fetch the orb? What's up, Martin? Gold and gem enough for any man. Gold and gems for any man? But return the orb to me. You'll pay me now, or I'll never get there. I need horses, supplies. Enough. Let the journey begin. Urgh. Hey, no, wait. No, wait. Wow, 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 wow. Live or die, adventurer, but bring the orb to me. But probably live, because otherwise you can't bring the orb. Dingus. There it is. That is the dungeon hack. What? what? My inside to be all twisted about. Shall we see what awaits? <laughs> ah, I'm bored. This whole intro song is exactly 16 measures long. Ah! <laughs> you just fucking bitch slaps him with a sword. Ooh. Bring Mood on shift. your worst, dungeon. I am ready. Drop bridge just crushes him. All right, that's the intro to Dungeon Hack. There you go. Thanks for humoring me, humoring me on that. Martin, thank you for the huge $150 donation. Merry Christmas to you, too. Thank you so much. Old Man Striker Bolt with 100 bits. Worst Tinder date ever. I don't know. There's probably worse. All right. Create character. Let's go. AD and D rules, baby. First. What kind of class are we going to make? Let's go... Oh, okay, so I can multi-class, not dual class. Not some shit. Okay. So. Uh, what do we, what do we want to play here? We always have to start a run as DF. Sure. We can, we'll start a, we can start off with the DF run. Oh, dang, this is actually pretty good. 18 dexterity, 18 wisdom. We'll do uh, some point by adjustments. Minus two to give plus one. To uh, The extra strength is pretty imperative in this game. Uh, wouldn't mind the extra constitution too, just so I have more hit points. 
I mean, he's 19, so that part's right. Will I play Tower of Doom this year? Oh, yeah, probably. I would love to do a uh, Tower of Doom run. Mm, no, nope, change my mind. Well, no. Yeah, okay, we'll do that. Uh, sure, looks good. Whatever. Done. DS. DS. Let's roll. So if you guys haven't seen this game before, uh, it is entirely a roguelike where every time you play, it makes a different dungeon. Uh, let's go 12 levels. Gotta put a little bit on the hard mode. I don't want any illusionary walls. Slight increase in the key frequency so I can pick more stuff. Pits, some. Uh, I don't want to encounter undead. Uh, character death real. On, obviously. Permadeath mode, baby. Uh, sure, we'll go with that. Generating dungeon. Graphics. Loading dungeon. So, here we go. This is the, uh, holding game. <laughs> <laughs> Auto Crypto, thanks for that resub. Love DD and having to watch this after working all day. Dude, you had to work all day? That sucks. Oh, what's up? Backstab! Uh, punch! Kill him with punch. Hello? So, this all this game is about is, uh, is get through the dungeon. That's it. Locked door? Not for DS. This lock is too complicated for me to pick. Just kidding. Just kidding. Oh, Hobgoblin. Hey, what's up, man? I'm already dual wielding. Even though I'm pretty sure I would be terrible at it in ADD. Is someone attacking me? Oh, a grappling hook. That could be useful for later. Uh, I don't have a diamond to put up in here. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, nothing? <laughs> Got him. Okay. I wonder if it's possible to mod in custom portraits. It is on older, certain older games. I don't know about this one. I tried digging around the game files and see if it's possible. But some, like, uh... Custom portraits would make this game way better. Oh, a crystal key. I haven't seen a crystal door yet. Nothing! Nothing! This game has a food meter? It sure does. If you're familiar with the Eye of the Beholder games, you'll find the gameplay in this pretty similar. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, ah. Murder. Oh, do you need a crystal key? Click. I did it. I'm noticing a distinct lack in, uh, treasure. Ah, <clears throat> oh, we got an orange potion. Uh, there are no other party members in this game. It's just you and your lonesome in this dungeon. No. Nope. Propane key with 100 bits. This game is way too intense for you. It gets pretty intense. I mean, I'm just on the first level. Is this game laughing at you? It sure is. You hear monsters laughing all the time. They're jolly. Ow. Come on. Please! This is why I gave myself extra strength so my thackle would be better. Oh, fuck! Eh. Ow! Alright, deserve that one. 
Who's opening doors? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, gloves of happy. I'll put them on real quick. Figure out what to do later. Ow, oh, bad, 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 low one health, bad, 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 And we're running. Uh, and we're running. Uh, into this corner. This looks good. Oh, sweet, those gauntlets are giving me 22 strength. So I got gauntlets of cloud giant strength. Rest. Please get my health back. I'm just gonna stay here in the dungeon for like five days. Did it. Good. Okay. <laughs> I have not checked this door yet. Treasure? So this whole game is just about running around, finding treasure. Killing shit. Basically, what most people thought D and D was way back in the day. I stabbed him for fifteen with a dagger. Oh! Now I'm dual wielding short swords. What a badass! I'll save that dagger for throwing. Murder. It's like Grimrock, but good. No, Grimrock's way better than this game. The water from this tub is cool and refreshing. Ow. Oh, gold. Got myself a GP. We did it. And a cedar wand. I don't know if I need the cedar wand on account that I'm beefy. Sup. That's me. You can't tell, but this is actually a mirror. The tapestry depicts a valiant warrior standing over the defeated enemy. I just hope that I'm as victorious as he. <laughs> you and me both. <clears throat> I'm thinking can. I don't think you can actually backstab in this game. Like, I don't think it's a mechanic that they programmed in. I could be wrong on that. So. I'll know I'm getting towards the exit down when I start seeing... There's, like, one slightly harder monster wandering around here. Usually it's a troglodyte. And if I see him, that's how I know I'm in the right direction. Ooh, another GP. Ow. Six damage? That's like half my health. How am I missing right now? Oh. Well, here's the stairway down, but I haven't found the hard enemy yet. Can I rest here? Rip my food. Hello? Well, I'm not gonna just not find that guy and kill him. Also, shout out to this game for having an auto map. Now, oh, apparently I missed a whole section down here. It may be a little bit up there. I'll go see if I can find some other treasure. This game have a timer mechanic. It does not have a timer mechanic. Um, the food usually drains mostly while resting. Oh, there's a chocolate dite. Got him! Look at all the stuff he dropped! A shield I'll never use, a staff I'll never use, uh, a parchment that I can read, and different gauntlets. Hold on, what does it say? I fear that a dragon could be here. There are signs of great lightning damage that only a blues breath weapon could do. Good, I'm glad. I actually can use the shield? Armor class 4. Oh, fuck! I can't take it off! It's cursed! No! <laughs> no! Oh, why'd I do that? Oh. 
Oh. Oh, what are these shackles? That's a chime. Just. There's so much for dual wielding stuff. God damn it. Alright. The suboptimal. <laughs> oh, man. That sucks so hard. I can't believe I just fucked myself like that. I essentially just, like, lost an arm. There we go, got him. Under the heal heading, pray for spells. Please enter the third ward. So this is their no what their old um, copyright protection was, where it would, would be, um, you would have to look into the instruction manual, go to page 21, and say... Under the paragraph, pray for spells, you type in the third word of that paragraph. The. Shit. Wait. Did it. But, because I got this off of GOG.com, they pretty much make it so that you will get past the thing no matter what. Ah! Eh. Eh. Hey, some boots! Way better than my shitty leather boots. Fuck these boots. These boots are better. I can't tell if my armor class actually got better with this. Let's see. Starts at 9. 18 dexterity. 6. Leather armor. Nope. It <clears throat> did not help. <laughs> eh. Hold on. <laughs> eh. Hold on. <laughs> eh. Hold on. <laughs> eh. Got him. Oh, hey. A pair of boots. What sort of creature is this? I can only hope that if I need to confront it, that I'll find the power to defeat it. Oh, silver piece. The boots are also cursed. They're not. They're just regular boots, thankfully. Fuck, can't we pick this lock? I haven't done shit as a thief. So, Vandreas, thanks for that resub. You may be a terrible rogue, but I still love you. I'm a fine rogue! Shut up! Oh, here's the crimson key. Oh, a second crimson key? Curious. Ow. Oh, fuck. I'm really glad I got these gauntlets, because, um... The troglodytes here can sap your strength if they hit you. But because I got the gauntlets, it'll be permanently at 22. <laughs> the sneak attack shield bash. I wish I could shield bash. Can't do shit with it. Ah, uh, take a throw! Yep, that's how, I, that's how I wanted to throw it. Sideways. Oh, some food, though. Iron rations. That's actually huge. Oh, and they're GP. <laughs> Protection from poison scroll. Could be useful later on. Gets my hit points back. Can I, um, dingle dingle? Bong. Bong bong. Wee. Ooh, I'll try to pick this one. I did it! Hello? Good adventures go left. Ah! Got him! I'll kill your friends too! Ow! Seven? Jesus! Oops. Another key in here. I need to sort my inventory. Oops. 
I'll put all the all my coins into the uh, second page. Cause you can only use them in certain areas. Got a lot. I got a fair amount of cash money though. That feels good. Um, I guess I could see what the other gauntlets do for me. Maybe they're better. Strength 19. Psh! Just drop those in the ground. Or save them forever because they're treasure. Might as well heal them here. The curse shield kind of looks like it has an, a Christmas tree on it. Yeah. Happy Dean December, everyone. Oh, hello. Mm. I was trying to eat, thank you. Mm. Oh. 100 bits from Propanky, a glass of wine, some fine cheese is perfect when watching your stream. I don't know why, but it gives off that vibe. I mean, I would go for that right now. I would happily have some wine and eat cheese while <laughs> streaming. <laughs> Dead end. Cool. When is a bad time for wine and cheese? That, that's fair. Maybe after like your seventh pack of gushers. Got it. More gauntlets? These look like exactly the ones I got before. Cool. I can sell them now. But there's also a ring here. A copper ring. I should put the ring on, right? <laughs> Saudi Smith, thanks for that Twitch Prime resub. Surely this ring isn't also cursed. Nee? Anything change? Well, it's not cursed, so it has some effect on me. It could be a ring of regeneration, which would make it I don't have to worry about food anymore. I'll have to figure it out later. My armor class change? No. So it's not a ring of protection. So it looks like this path down here is where I want to go. Cash money. Ring of fashion. <clears throat> exactly. It's a ring of fashion, everyone. Good adventures go left. And find this dogwood wand. What's it do? Pew! Uh. Oh, here's one of those things. I'm actually not injured, though, so it doesn't matter. So I believe this is just a wand of displacement, which just shifts monsters away to somewhere else, somewhere on the level. Bang! Bye! Yeah, see, he's not dead, he's just gone. Oh, he's right there! Uh, fuck, uh, eh! Nothing happens, it's just a stick. Oh, fuck, fuck, sword! Uh, 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 suck stick! Uh, please. I'll beat you with this stick. Got him. Okay. A key of faith. Okay, quick sticks to snakes. Where was I going? Dang, that's everything. So it's actually all the way up north. All right. Hello. Ow. Please. Ow. 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 Got him. Alright. Let's see what happens when I rest. See if I regenerate. A little bit. I, I feel like I healed faster than normal. Grows weaker? Yeah, troglodytes... Uh, can lower your strength temporarily when they hit you. With 
their poison spears and stuff. Ha! Yo, know, speaking of D&D &D stuff, though, y'all see the uh, Game Awards, right? I had to, I had to get caught up on it after it happened. But I did get caught up on everything that happened and saw all the stuff. Not the winners, but at least the, the announcements and trailers and things. So, do y'all see that trailer for the new Dark Alliance game? Because, uh... Man, what a piece of shit trailer. <clears throat> like, not only did... Like, as soon as the music started and brought me immediately back to 2002, I was just like... Okay, but then like GoPro attached to Drizzt was not like was not something I ever needed to see, nor was that cool. It was just kind of disoriented. I'm fucking dying. Bye, 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 bye. Uh, yeah, like none of the character models were like pleasing to look at. They were just like ugly. Alcas Games, thanks that resub. I have to eat more food. <laughs> like, I already don't like the Dark Alliance games just because they're not really <laughs> my style. I prefer, like, actual RPG versus, you know, hack and slash games. But, like, that trailer made, made me be like, yeah, I never want to play this. <laughs> no, thank you. It feels like they're still trying to go for that crowd from like 20 years ago. Much like Joe Manganiello trying to make like that Death Saves brand and be like, yeah, dude, we played D&D. &D. We all had like our metal rock posters on the wall wearing all black and just talk about how cool it is to kill shit. It's like, ooh, yeah, it's not. No. That's not how it is. Random life. Thanks for that resub. Also, Darlax92. What's the Christmas with the Christmas tree tree buckler? Uh, put it on, see what happened. It's cursed. Can't take it off. Anyway, I guess what I'm trying to say is that Dark Alliance 2, that new Dark Alliance trailer was really fucking awful. They should be ashamed of themselves. And I probably won't play the game regardless if it was good. I'm cursed with the spirit of Christmas. It's true. Ow. But, uh, yeah. Bravely to all two. Fucking hell. <laughs> Why must I be so fragile? Vintage cube on arena in the future. I wouldn't get your hops up anytime soon, my dude. How balanced is this game? Is one class considered e easy mode? Uh, being any kind of spellcaster certainly gives you an advantage. Just from having the identify spell alone. Because then you can actually tell what things are what. And that is very, very useful. But all the dungeons are completely randomly generated, so it's like, what you get is what you get. It's not intended to be balanced for anything. Ow. Oh man, there's a lot of monsters coming. You can find things to help you identify, but you have to find that. Whereas if you start off as a wizard, you can just have the spell identify whenever you need it. I 
I think they were just an event for Arena Martin. Or they're adding those cards in for their dumbass historic mode. Who cares? <laughs> I have not found the exit yet. Guess I'll check down here. Hello? Ah! Fuck! Oh, more food! Thank God! Desperately needed that! Ow! Ah, carrion crawler! Fuck! Fuck, fuck! Fuck! Nee. Alright, well, the exit's that way. Um... I could try to kill it. Or teleport it away and just get past him. <laughs> oh, it's so gross. It's so gross. You. Yeah, hit him for 13. Do not paralyze me. Ah. I killed him. Oh, thank God. Gauntlets and a uh, sling. Oh, these gauntlets are different than these gauntlets. Are they better gauntlets? If I put these on, what happens to me? Oh, the gauntlets of dexterity. The strength bonus is more helpful for me right now. So I'll stick with the strength. Okay. Well, if he was here, that means the exit's right here. Yay! Progress! Oh, look. <clears throat> Sorry, was that a rare rat? That's a rare rat. Fuck me, are you kidding me? I can't kill rare rats. It's a lycanthrope. You can only damage them with magical or silver weapons. I've got either of those. A bull's horn? Toot? No? Okay. Ha! Ha! Hold on. Ha! Hold on. Please. 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 Got him. We're at. Oh, just went. He's teleport behind me. Cool. Uh, sounds like a problem for later, Diaz. I'm not gonna be able to beat this. There's no way. Um, ooh, a diamond. Treasure. Ah, fuck! No, uh, uh, What? No, pew! Fuck! Button. Alright. Go ahead and take your bets now, chat, because I'm going to die on this level. Fuck. Some more gauntlets? Oh, uh, rations. Numb. Uh, a journal page. Let's read it. A closed instrument, this loot of well-being is also said to strengthen a weakened bard. Cool. If I ever play a bard, I'll keep that in mind. 
for now, I am actually running for my life. Bzoom. No! Bzoom. Fuck! It doesn't last long enough. Uh, please? Club. Ha! He didn't care. Ow! Dying! Fuck! Q to cut me off! No! Oh. Well! Alright, well that was our first run. Now do we want to play? What's wants to be a character? Chat. What's wants to be a character? I saw Savandrius first. Savandrius. What kind of character do you, do you want to be? What class? Paladin? Alright. We'll do a... Uh, male Paladin. Lawful good, because you have to. You also have to be human. Get you some good stats. You have a minimum of 17 charisma. Well, I don't foresee it getting much better than that. We'll do the uh, minus two to plus one a stat, though. Get you a little bit more hit points. You don't need no intelligence. There we go. Which one? This is this is you. Congratulations, everyone. This is the tale of Sabandrius. As he goes through the dungeon hack. Just keep this the same. Go. Not dumb paladin. He still had above average intelligence. Okay. The very first thing Savandrius finds is a bone key and a stone key. His armor class is also seven, which was worse than Dieth's. Also not great on the hit points. You're able to turn undead and lay on hands. You're not going to get actual cleric spells until like your level, was it, level 8 or 9 or something like that? Oh. Two bone keys and a stone key? Damn. You have a, you do have a long sword at least. A key of faith? Well, I sure turned on Undead appearing, if I was going to play a Paladin. <clears throat> oh well. It's too late now. goblins here and this rubber mallet it's red yay it's not a weapon or anything it's used to open doors how's the charity auction is really cool 
Never been to anything like that before. It was really fun. All right, you're damaged slightly. So, lay on hands. Boom, boing, 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 boing. Yay, your hit points are back. You're finding a lot of keys. Oh, an amulet, a spooky amulet. Savandrius, do you wear it? Heck yeah. Boom, what's it do? Nothing. <laughs> but does it shoot? <laughs> it is an amulet of recall. So any point in time, you can use that amulet to return to the level entrance. <laughs> Swift Blade with the resub. This kind of looks like Stone Keep. I mean, it's a first person dungeon crawler. I believe it actually uses the same engine as the Eye of the Beholder games for PC. Ha! Mm. Eh. Oh, you dropped a coin! A gold coin! How does the amulet know you're in a dungeon? Magic. Duh. And there are such things as intelligent items. Ah. Oh, so here's where you use the red mallet. We did it. Ooh, another sword? Ow. A two-handed sword? Dang, is this a paladin of a two-handed sword, Savandrius, or do you rock the Ankh and long sword? Go for like the sword and shield look. Savandrius says equip it. Shink! <laughs> it's not cursed, so there's that. Not stalking the halls with both hands in the blade. Whack! Come on. Ow. Come on. Get hit. Shops for 15. There's an alcove up here with nothing in it. Oh, but here we go. Check this out. Going. And you're healed. May not seem like much, but it saves you from having to use food to restore yourself. And since you don't have a whole lot of rations, it can be very helpful. Good ventures go left. Chop. <laughs> Chop. 17 damage. Oh, this place takes another one of those keys we found at the beginning of the dungeon. Great. Alright. Might as well rest up. <laughs> Murder. Murder. Oh, we actually found some iron rations. Sick. Just a quick 30-hour nap. Yeah, you know. Have you not done that? Wait, this whole place? It's a dead end. Oh, fuck. And lo, Savandrius. Doth did get lost on his first day on the job. Ah. 
Hello there. Do you have my nose? Thank you. Hmm. <coughs> Ooh, another amulet. It's another amulet of imminent return. Well, you don't need to. Key of Faith. <laughs> Ow. Oh, we need to lay on some hands here. There we go. <clears throat> How much is the lay on hands? Is like two hit points per level? Uh, per paladin level or something like that? So he can just heal himself for six right now. Good venture, go left. Ooh, a rock. Ooh, and some bracers. They are... They're cursed bracers. It's giving you negative three armor. Oops! Now you have an armor class of 10. Everything's gonna hit you. <laughs> Agent Snelling said Twitch Prime resub. You're welcome? Yeah, but like, look at all these other things. Ow, ow. Oh my god. Just everything's gonna hit. Alright, here's the thing. Everyone's gonna- everyone is going to beat the shit out of you. And that's just gonna be a fact of life. This game uses specific d, &D edition rule set, like Neverwinter's Night or Baldur's Gate? Yeah, it uses AD and D 2nd edition. So, like, Baldur's Gate. Running out of places to go. <laughs> Into this door? Ow, seven damage. Oh, look, other gauntlets. These one looks decidedly less cursed. Uh oh. We're out. Give me a second. Lay on hands. All right, ready. Yeah. Yeah. We have a key for this door. But what's through this door? Another smaller passageway. The hidden button. Missed. One second. One second. One second. Ow. Fuck. We're gonna die in here. And we're gonna rest. How do you get rid of cursed items? Um. I think there are magical things you can find that can remove curses. But they are few and far in between. <laughs> Save at the resub. Dungeon Hacks probably your favorite D&D game I've played. Which i played... Go watch me live more. Damn work. Yeah, damn work. Forget that. Skip work. Watch me play D&D games. Yeah, there is a remove curse spell, but he's not going to be getting that as a paladin. So right now, the strat is to hit someone with the two-handed sword and kill them before they get a chance to swing at you. That's all we got. Grappling hook. Walk into this. <laughs> Fuck, missed. There we go. A popular wand? What do you do? 
Just... It's just a stick. Okay. Some wand. I was just got to find the troglodyte. Or whatever the monster is down here so we can get all of his fat loot. There's a goblin. Hmm. Oh, hobgoblin. Hobgoblins are generally easier to fight than like a troglodyte. Chop! Coin. Ha! Uh oh. Ow! Eight damage. Uh, lay on hands. Oh, we just hit him for 21. He didn't give a fuck. There we go. Another 16. Uh, gauntlets that you can't wear because you're cursed. But we did it. Well, look at this way. You're making it to level 2 at least. Dungeon level 2, that is. Hemi powered Chiro Chow with 110 bits. Did you see the new Chow in Space video that came out yet? No. Please. Got it. Yeah, they, they buffed Hobgoblins in 5th edition. Oh, speaking of. Ow. Oh, God, this is going to be rough. Don't suppose you're, uh. See, you're at what? 6,000 experience points? When do you level up again? Oh, good. Don't worry, dude. You'll level up as soon as you get 12,000 experience points. Halfway there, let's go. Oh, Trogger Knights! Ah! Oh. Eh, fuck. Eh, got one. Okay. Yeah, paladins level up pretty slow back in the day, turns out. Ooh, a potion of magenta. I don't give a shit. My arms went numb for a second. All right. How much is that chocolate I experienced? Like 50. Please. Eight damage. Oh! At one hit point. Uh, die? Got him. Didn't all fighter classes level slower than mages in the old editions? Opposite. Mages were far slower than fighters. Fighters were, like, average. Thieves were fast. Clerics... Were... Thieves were the fastest, followed by clerics. And then it's, like, fighter and any other specialty class and caster class. It was so much slower. That's how they tried to offset the power of spells. If you six to the 500 biddies, making them D6s appear. I'm not blocking that up, am I? No, okay. Uh, a crystal key! Fuck! Ow. Ha! Give him the old run around. Hello. Got him. And we're resting. Don't worry, I'll, I'll keep you well fed, Savandrius. A log sword? Psh. All we gotta do is find a thing that lets you, uh, you know, remove a curse. Then, then you're golden. Or better armor, because you're still just wearing what? Chainmail? Ringmail. mail. 
I've been in here. Where am I? Damn it. And we're going back. Going back. Good adventures go left. The door? Ha! Shit! Ow. Surprisingly, the troglodytes have not sapped your strength at all yet. Because then, when that happens, then you're really in trouble. Hello, friend. Please get hit. Hobgoblin friend, thank you. Hey! Oh yeah! Uh, a protection from level drain? Dang, why would I need that? Please. Uh, a staff. Do anything cool? Ow. Oh, no. Come on. Come on. Mm, come on! <sighs> How does level drain work? Do you sap the experience out of someone? So you lose a level, and your experience points get drained down to what the minimum would be to reach that level. ADD was a cruel mistress. <laughs> Crystal key. Oops. Ah, I'm Savandrius. How? Make key work lock. Fuck. Uh oh. There we go. Uh, he dropped a rose key. And there's a, another key of faith at the end. And a safe place to rest. Yeah, level drain is super harsh. Like, you know the process of how long it takes to, like, figure out your character when you level up? Imagine trying to figure out when you go backwards. The Final Fantasy XI level down jungle is just the worst. Damn it! Eh. Oh, you got a friend. Let's go. Eh. Yeah, I'll kill both! I don't give a fuck. Savandrius. Lay on hands. Full hit points. Dead end. Or is it? <laughs> Boop. Oh. <laughs> Ow. All right, so he's down to seven hit points after that attack. <laughs> No. Oh, no. <clears throat> uh, there we go. Did I lay on hands already? I did. Cool. You're going to sleep in this hallway. Am I excited for the new Dark Alliance game? I talked about it a little bit earlier. And I, honestly, no. Not at all. <laughs> Aside from not already liking the Dark Alliance games, that was just a really bad trailer. And I hit Drizzt. I think Drizzt sucks. Please. You know, at this rate, because he's getting sit so often, having to rest this much, Savandrius might just starve to death. If nothing else claims his life. Oh, here's the Healy thing, of course. Oh, there it goes. There it is. Strength drained. Okay, going poorly. Fuck. And then I heard a carrying crawler behind him. Um, coin! Urgh, fuck. Ow, ow. Yeah, this is bad. We're, this is, this, we're gonna deal with that in just a little bit. Like, going down from 18 over 96 strength down to 17. That lose so many, like, damage and two hit bonuses. 
there it goes again. Dude! Savandrius killed by cursed fashion bracers and two troglodytes. So, rip that. All right, who's next? Dimensional wizard. What's that resub? I saw Judea on the chat earlier. We can do, uh, we can make his ranger. Let's see. Any chance you can start at level four? No? Okay. See what sucks is 80 in D. If you want to make a ranger. I'm making you a human so you can actually gain levels, my good sir. If you're elf or half elf, you max out at level 8. You have to be human to get to higher levels. This is AD&D rules, so bow rangers basically blow ass and you need to be a two weapon fighting ranger. This game was racist? That's AD&D rules, baby! That's how they threw a bone to... Uh... Humans. Yeah. Racist and sexist. I guess we'll go with this. Uh, to Doran looks like this guy. Play. <laughs> yes, you win with elf ears. You know, you do that. Alright, so Jadale, you're just holding your rations in your hand like a dingus. You got some ring mail, a long sword, armor class 5, you're at 4,500 experience points. What's your, uh, what's your level 4 at Ranger? 10,000. Okay. A little more reasonable, we'll see how it goes for Jadale here. Purple hammer! Yay! Bullhorn! Whoop. Well, I already found a second sword, so now you can dual wield. No collection of that gendered strength stuff. It was a... It was an AD and d first edition at the very least. I think they kept it in second. Maybe they didn't. Hell yeah, I guess. A grappling hook. Ah, da. Yeah. This is another one of those games I played a lot as a kid. And then when I tried to play actual Dungeons and Dragons, I thought it was supposed to play like this. Oh, book! These are huge! Or devastating, depending on how it goes. Alright. Double check Jadale's stats here, everyone. Try to remember this. Read the book. Jadale's gained a point of intelligence. Now you're smarter. From reading. 
Books can also just straight up give you like a full level of experience points. Or take stats away and make you dumb. He's killed, like, what, 10 enemies so far? He's gained a total of 36 experience points off of him. <laughs> yeah, coin. All right, so he killed that orc, right? Boom. Nine experience. <sighs> See, like, you're basing it off AD&D rules, and AD&D rules gave you experience points based on, like, the gold pieces and treasure you found. But this game doesn't do that. So you just level up like ass the whole time. I think it does give you a bonus chunk of experience points every time you find the stairway down. But bro, a dart! Hell yeah. And another silver piece. Oh, just dropped a mace. Gold key door. Don't have the gold key. A fire key <clears throat> door. Are you also need a key? Nope. Yeah, this game is completely randomly generated every time you play. So I recall on the box, it's like, this is all has over two billion dungeons. Jadale's gonna dual wield a club and a mace. No, he's not. <laughs> Look, chat, real quick. This door's locked! Tis needs a fire key in order to pass through! Oh wait, here we go. Hey, bracers! And an amulet! I don't know, Jadil, you wanna put them on? I didn't ask if you were afraid. I said, do you want to put them on? The amulet is likely an amulet of imminent return. Because even though it like, is a different shape, it can have the same effect. Necklace first. Bink! Uh, no changes from the necklace. Yeah, so it's probably an imminent return necklace. Which, would that be helpful right now? That could be at some point. And now the bracers. Bracers! Oh! They are bracers of protection plus one. You're gonna need a point of armor class. They're good bracers. Thanks for the heals! I've only ever beat this game, like, once. So I know what the ending is. Oh, here's another dart. Ooh. A vermilion potion. Let me know whenever you're thirsty. <laughs> Fashion bra bracers of a tougher boy. Um, yeah, I actually think it might be better to teleport at this point. Watch. Wow, wow, wow. Yep, it's imminent return. Which is actually kind of a shortcut. Because now we can go check this door that we neglected earlier. Shit. Ooh. Another silver coin? Ooh. Second amulet of imminent return. We don't need two amulets of imminent return. That's too much returning. Not that imminent. 
To cat up 300 bits, thank you so much. Any chance of playing one of those games made this millennium? Like Neverwinter Nights or Kingmaker? Neverwinter Nights, yes. Kingmaker, probably not. Also, what's wrong with you playing old games? Why you gotta hate on good games? Chop. Chop. Hello? Was wizardry ever considered a part of D&D &D anything, or just take t cues from D&D? &D? It just took cues from D&D. &D. Wizardry was entirely separate. But, like, very similar. And wizardry's balls hard. Hello? Gold key? Another short sword? I don't know if it's a magical short sword or not. Where am I going? This way, right? That's one way. Oh, they finally found the fire key that we don't even need. I have played all the High of the Beholder games, too. I honestly like Dungeon Hack more. My main problem with the Eye of the Beholder games is that you create this party, but because they use that weird row system, like, your back two characters or four characters eventually, like, has to... Um, have to have ranged weapons to even, like, participate at all. And that sucks. Because I'd make, like, a fighter cleric... And then I want to make a rogue, but then I can't actually, like, attack from the back row. That's lame. Is this combat real-time or turn-based? Kind of real-time. I have, like, attack cooldowns. Like, I'm clicking on these to actually do them. A second gold key. Could the back use darts? Yeah, but darts are dumb. And isn't backstabs. <laughs> Also, that one part in Eye the Beholder 1, where you get that one part of the dungeon and it tries to fuck you up by turning you around as you walk forward. Fuck that. Where have I been? Well, I guess since we got the keys, it has to be down here, right? Whoop. FLC rocks or fully coolie rocks. Thanks to 555. I've heard a smile from Miles, but your character has a frown that goes down. Hmm. <laughs> was there a thing on the ground at the dead end? I don't think so. If it was, it's probably garbage. <laughs> Please get hit. Thank you. Uh, up to 4,800 experience. We got like 300 experience points on this one level. Just another 5,200 to go. I forgot how I got there. Damn. Alright, maybe I should not have used the amulet. Oh well. Wanna go straight down or take the outside route? Outside route. Uh, yep. Have I beaten this game? I have. I can tell you the ending. It's not like crazy exciting by any means. 
At least what I remember it being. Ow. Any New Year's streams plans? I don't know. Come on by. Chop, chop. Mm, fuck. Chop, chop. Fuck. Eat damage. Holy shit. All right, bye. Ass, 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 ass. <clears throat> oh, I guess I live here now. Uh, run far way farther. And we're finally resting. Seventy hours later, we're good to go again. All down in there. And there's a bunch of treasure there, though. Mm, treasure. Oh, it's the club and mace I threw earlier. <laughs> Probably ignoring those. You get experience from combat. And in this game, it's pretty much better to fight as much as you can. Backstab! Hey, we found you Dale's first arrow! Put that in his quiver. And his throwing rock. Have not seen the hobgoblin or the troglodyte for yet, though. We want to kill him for all his stuff. Unless that dude was it? No, it can't be it. There'd be way better stuff. But floor, still on the first floor. We just died not too long ago. After wearing <laughs> cursed bracers. That were fashionable. Hello? Big monster man? Was that a hopgon? I thought it was just another orc. All right, fuck it, I guess. Going down. Under the heading Dungeon Death, please enter the Ninth Ward. Easily. The best thing you could do. Oops. Eas easily the best. Got it. See, look, you got, uh, you got like 500 extra experience points for going downstairs. I've, like, leveled up as a thief before even reaching the second level before. And there's troglodytes. Eh. Got him with the rock. Rock throw, bitch. Rock throw. Give me that. Rock throw. A silver key. No, rock. I'm getting the way, rock. Crimson key. Which goes right here. There's two keys in this water. Another crimson key. Why are there so many crimson keys? Rock throw! Uh, uh. Rock throw! Rock throw! Kill him with the rock! He dropped another arrow! Cool, so now we're up to two arrows. Damn. Oh, he dropped rations! Ow! Uh. Nice. Another silver piece. Hmm. 
Was there a button for- oh, it was right there. Duh. Was the deepest I've made it? I've beaten the game before. This was like, you know, two decades ago. I couldn't remember what dungeon it was. Or what level floor I set it to. Don't sap the strength. We got darts for days. I guess I could be throwing darts instead of rocks. Might be a little bit better. Whoop, bye. And it's gone forever. Dark throw! Fuck. A lot of keys on this floor in particular. Oh, we got a Healy thing. Don't mind if I do. Another key? This one's a bone key? <clears throat> Apparently all the treasures Jadale finds are keys. <clears throat> rather than actual useful things. Here's one crimson door. That's the second crimson door on this floor alone. More food? Dude. That said, like, the mundane equipment he's finding has been pretty great. All these darts. He's found the most food of everyone by far. And actually having good armor class turns out kinda helps. <laughs> yep, here it is, the third crimson door. Not guarding anything important, it's just in the way. Hello? <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> I can't tell if that was the were rat or a carrion crawler. I want to say it was a were rat. If it's another were rat, Jadale's fucked. Another club? <laughs> Ready my throwing dart. Got it. <laughs> ah. Got him. <laughs> ah! Whoa, what the fuck? Ah! Uh, uh, <laughs> Funny lot of wall alcoves, but just no treasure inside. Oh. There we go. Second longsword. Oh, that's right, you can't do a build with that. Never mind. Back to short sword. Alright, let's uh take a moment and rest. Get the hit points back, get his uh, strength back up. The dart didn't go anywhere, what a bro. <laughs> dart throw! <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> uh, we've been betrayed by the dart. <laughs> There we go. Ha! Ha! Hello? 
Boneface? At least we're finding a place for all these keys. I walked into the own dart. That was foolish of me. That dart killed him! The trusty dart. Where at? Where at? He's in front of the door. Where did I leave the Healy slot? Is there, I don't know if there's a good way to get around him. Test of the longsword is magical by trying to hit him. I think it was actually magical. It would look different than this longsword. From what I remember of the game. Like, you'd be able to tell. <clears throat> hey! What? Wait. It did 9 damage to him. No, wait. He actually died? Got a periwinkle potion out of it. And another book. Let's read it. He's gained a point of strength. Judeal has 19 strength. <laughs> the magic was inside of me all along. Chat, is this it? Will Judeal be the one? Going downstairs. <laughs> I didn't read that book. I just ripped it in half. Down into dungeon three. A silver key was found. I'm going to take this grappling hook and just put it on the other page. Because we'll like, never need it. <laughs> Actually shift the food over there too. <laughs> ha! It's fucking working. I'm not misremembering that, right? Chat. Someone who remembers AD&D a little bit better than me. You needed silver or magical weapons, even damage, yeah. like ropes. <laughs> He's trying to confirm with myself that I am indeed killing his were rat somehow. Yeah. So many keys. Yeah, I remember playing this and not being able to do damage before. I put all your food on the second page of inventory. You still got them. Just one shots it. Click. Key to treasures? Like this jade. And another dart friend. Ooh. This might be a dart plus one. And a bow! A short bow! So we can actually put the swords away and just... Dunk. And then save these two arrows forever. <laughs> Yo, come here. I want to try shooting you. Dunk. Fuck, missed. Dunk. I hit him. <clears throat> Now we truly are a ranger. I'm gonna stick with the swords though. 
But if we end up seeing something that is like super threatening and dangerous, we have the bow option to start dealing extra damage, which is super cool. Sorry! Uh. Don't worry about it. There's nothing to worry about at all. Just eat yourself a gusher and everything's gonna be okay. Mmm. Delicious gusher. Okay. I'm gonna pull out the bow for that guy. Alright, let's see if we can find him again. Since it seemed like some of the chat missed it. Uh. There he is! Oh god! Thunk! Fuck! Thunk! No, no! Thunk! Oh, 10 damage! Dead. Those are magic missiles that came out, by the way. All right, who's next? He was doing well until, you know, all that. <laughs> Life's hard, guys. Sumotachi? Sure, we'll, we'll send in Sumotachi. Sumotachi, you're gonna be, um... You're gonna be a, just a flat-out cleric, though. A dwarf female male cleric. Who's neutral good. Five charisma?! Eighteen Constitution. We're actually trying to get oh seventeen strength, nine intelligence, eighteen wisdom, nine. This is this is awesome. This is perfect. Look at this. This is great. Done. Uh. Yep. All right, Sumitachi. I mean, if you're going to be a cleric, we need to have the undead monsters. I think you were a level four already. Yeah, you're already level 4. Armor class 5. Cure light wounds. Alright, first off. That needs to get fixed. Alright, let's get your spells. So, let's see. Detect magic is always helpful. So is bless. Wand protection from evil just in case. Put the rest into cure light wounds. 
And then for your level two spells, um, dang, spiritual hammers always is just super good. Flame blade is awesome, and then we'll try hold persons. Try for that. All right, get your spells. All right, Sumatachi, this is your dwarven cleric adventure. <coughs> Bash. <coughs> your food in the next page. This is a fancy dungeon you're in. It's got all this glass. <laughs> Bash! Come on. Bash. 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 There we go. Solheim, thanks for that resub. Fuck. Please. Alright, your chance hit isn't very good, but you're finding food already. Let's uh, throw down a Cure Light Wounds. That's the Cure Light Wounds sound effect? Sure, man. <laughs> Alright, because I want to try this. Hold person! <laughs> Bash! Holy shit, that was awesome. <laughs> Ow. Hold person! <laughs> Oh, we don't have that. <laughs> Guys, we just put protection from evil up. That should last a good while. Get you extra armor class against all these evil beings. Whoops. Ow. Come on. <laughs> they're not evil, they're trying to defend themselves from a home in danger. If I'm what I call from the plot, that lady who wants you to go find the orb is evil, or the orb itself is evil, or something like that? Uh oh. Uh, flame blade! Whoops. Forgot to do my thing. Fine. Spiritual hammer! Check this shit out. Bless! <laughs> hammer throw! And it comes back. Hammer throw! Ooh, dropped a ring! Putting it on, don't give a fuck. Boop! It, uh... Wait. To do a thing? Detect magic? It is magical. I just can't tell what it does. Let's take a hot minute just to rest up. All right, flame blade. There we go. Now you got a fire sword. Let's go. Could be a ring of sustenance. Could be. Or a ring of underwater breathing. Fire! 
This does so much more damage than that dumbass mace. Fire! Oh, uh... Protection from evil! Yeah, if you do uh, detect magic and it glows red, it means it's cursed. Which I guess I should have cast before I put it on. But oh well. Ow. You took seven damage and that was it? What was your maximum hit points again? More rations. Oh, you asshole. Hit me in the back. Is that a magic mace? Ooh, it's a magical mace. That actually might be worth holding on to. Fuck this piece of shit mace. Good, you're our friends. Fire sword. Fire sword. Ow. Is it weird they make fighter clerics just to use flame blade? Oh, it's not weird at all. Like having a flame blade at the ready, plus like the fighter strength to actually swing it really hard. Oh, we found the downstairs. Let's see if we can't find the uh, big boy for his treasure. Oh, there he is. Hey, big boy. Hold person. <laughs> Murder. Hold on. Murder. Yeah. It's a magic rock and magic gloves. Can't tell what the gauntlets do. Oh, plus two dexterity? Neat. It has no actual benefit for you right now because your dexterity is so low, but there you go. Uh, under the heading watch ghost, please enter the third word sub using Twitch Prime. Correct! And that's the end of that bit. What are the actual stats of the flame blade and the spiritual hammer anyways? Ah! Cool! Turn on dead! <laughs> ah! I got him! Just like I planned. Mr. Honido, thank you for that Twitch Prime sub. Did that seriously turn him around? That's what Turn Undead does. So, if you're unfamiliar with Turn Undead, it literally calls upon the power of your deity to uh, invoke fear unto the undead. It makes them run away, but then as you become a more powerful cleric, that goes from making them run away to paralyzing them to then outright destroying them. Or, if you're an evil cleric, controlling them. Oh, here you go. <laughs> Please. I think those are ghouls and not... 
I think that's a ghoul and not uh, a zombie. So I'm pretty sure it can paralyze with this touch. Fuck. Oh, fuck. A uh, cleric scroll of cure critical wounds. A throwing hammer. Mjolnir! And a moonstone. So, that hammer is not magical, but we can just create one, so what's the point? Well, Flame Blade is expired. So, speaking of... <laughs> spiritual Hammer! <laughs> Fuck, it missed. Come back, come back. Oh, I, can't, I got him on the swing back! That was awesome! <laughs> Hello. Look at the size of the teeth on that thing. Well, I see no reason to stick my hand in there. Unless you want some treasure. Uh, oh. Can I put a moonstone in your mouth? <laughs> nope. <laughs> this carving, while frightful in appearance, is quite harmless. The only purpose for it I can think of is to ward off would-be themes. Humph. <laughs> <laughs> Bless! Ha! Shit, hold on. Ha! Oh, there's. This is right with the moonstone. With the moon. Boop. Oh, in the back. This tapestry appears to be dedicated to the element of water. Very astute, Simotachi. Well done. Glad we could rely on you. Oh, a shield! Dang, we actually put the, uh... Yeah, we actually just do a spiritual hammer and a shield for a hot second. Get plus one armor class. I'll throw on hammers. Oh, you got the pool of radiance? What are the sheets of gold for? Is that sheets of gold in game or something else? Shit. Please come back. Hammer, thank you. From the library. They might just be like high value selling items. I'm I don't 100% remember to be honest. So it's not a ring of sustenance because the food meter is still going down. Oh, more magic bracers. So if those are armor class plus two, these are, or I'm sorry. So these are dexterity plus two and these are just armor class plus one. So now he's down to three armor class. Oh, he dropped a magic wand and some food. What does this do? Acid spray? Hell yeah! Whoops. You know, just in case. So if you get paralyzed, is it pretty much game over? I mean, if you get paralyzed, you can still run? For some reason? But, like, everything will murder the shit out of you. Ha! Ah. Fuck. What 
the fuck? What is that? What is that? Is that just a shade? Got killed by a hammer though. Good. Protection from magic. A flail. And a coin. Oh, well, spooky. Progress. They're gonna level up soon. Could it happen? Could we actually see a level up? We're on the third floor. We haven't made it past the third floor of this stream. Fucking stupid plus one rock, who cares? At least summon a throwing hammer. More undead, cool. Oh, some magical leather armor. And an orange potion. Is it better than the chainmail? I think it ends up being the same. Yeah, it's the same. Flavor. Going for the chainmail rather than the leather armor. Oh, detect magic has expired. Cure light wounds. Good job cursing the run. Want some more food? Ha! Flower key? Nope, gold key. Here's another gold key, because the flower key goes here. Keys on keys, everyone. <clears throat> Having to swap to the holy symbol is doo-doo. Yeah, I mean, I wish there were, like, configuration quick slot buttons I could press. That if I want to swap to, like, sword and shield or, like, quick to, like, magic spelling or whatever, I didn't have to, like, manually click all that stuff over, because that is a pain. It's one of the most annoying things about this game, but... Whatever. Oh, there's another one! <gasps> hey, round hammer! Ran on a hammer! Acid! Acid? Acid! I got him! And now I'm going to take a moment to just rest in here, get our spells back. Okay. Let's see. Um, spiritual hammer. And protection from evil. Still get that shield though. Get that extra point of armor class. Make all the difference. I do have a melee weapon, but I'm currently using magic. But we're, we're able to con conjure weapons right now, and that's what I'm using. <laughs> Fuck. Got him. A protection from petrification scroll. There will come a time where that's going to be super helpful. Headed south? Yeah. I'm just going to throw this. If it hits someone, it hits someone. <laughs> A protection from gas scroll? This is not the right key. Dang. Ha! Uh, Just in case. Ha! Okay, we're good. Ha! Oh, a topaz. Treasure. Whew. 
Another shield? Ooh! This looks like a fancy shield. Is it cursed? Detect magic! Yeah, well, it's not magical at all, but might still be better than the wooden shield we're using. Nope, the same amount of armor class, but just looks way cooler, so we're gonna get- we're gonna use the fancy shield. His shield returns. <laughs> fashion shield. Got to protect ourselves from bad fashion. Oh no! It is not cursed. If it was cursed, it'd be glowing red after I cast detect magic. So we have a way of telling if it's cursed or not. Fuck! Did I one shot him? <laughs> Don't touch me. I kind of hate the shades. Running shouts. <clears throat> Not this south, other south. Better south. <clears throat> That's not the right key? Dang it. Okay, guess I can go this way though. Do you need a topaz for your staff? No? Damn. <laughs> Spooky noises. Alright. Getting a little... A little turned around. Okay. My goal is just to get past dungeon level 3. That's all I want. It's a humble goal. Fuck! Uh, Hammer! Uh, uh. There we go. How are you in an experience? Almost there. There ain't nothing in here. Damn it. Where else can I go? Am I dumb? I couldn't go this way because I didn't have the key, right? Like this isn't... I feel like most of these places I can't actually get past right now because I don't have the right... right locks top right of the map? Oh fuck, all the way at the stairs? Damn, I think you're right. And I don't have the amulet of imminent return. God, Sumitachi's run sucks. <clears throat> the bottom left was locked. I couldn't get through it. Alright, I swear to god, this is a dead end. Oh, we're, this is where I use this key, so there's that. Uh, there it is, there's the chrome key. I had to go all the way back here to get the one key I needed to go all the way back to where I just was so I can use it. But we found the key! So thanks, chat.
Which door was that? I don't remember which door that was. Is it this one? Yes, okay. Progress! I see you. Ha! Got it. Ha! Double kill. Fuck. Hammer, come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. Here. And we found a ruby. And a holy key. Oh, holy keys for that other door I couldn't get through. Oh, there we go. Okay, so now I can go back to those other doors and open those up. Oh, spiritual hammer went away. One second, not ready. Not ready. Flame blade! Okay, I'm ready. Yeah, I think the ruby is for that snake staff. Which I believe is this way? Ruby? It likes the ruby! Something around the corner. Oh, fuck! Flamed it. He's got a friend. Flame sword! Fuck! No, don't diddle me. Sumitachi attains cleric level 5, gaining 6 hit points! Level up! You done it! Oh, this is where we put the topaz! Hell yeah! So now we got more spells that we can memorize. Let's get a second spiritual hammer. And you can now get level 3, create food and water. That's the best. Remove curse, remove paralysis. What is magical vestment? I don't know that spell. Well, prayer is super good. It's like mage armor for clerics. I'll give it a shot, whatever. All right, let's do some science here. Magical vestments? It didn't help. Okay. Prayer! Spiritual hammer! Put on that shield, baby. <clears throat> yeah, I wasn't sure if I had to unequip my armor or not first. I love that the throw sound effect is very clearly just some guy going Whew! in his microphone, and they just kept it. Whew. Another mace, potentially magical. Uh. Fuck. Uh. Hey! Ah. <clears throat> uh. 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 Oh god, there's so many of them! The hammer missed. Come back, hammer. Hammer, don't miss. Come back. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There. Okay. Oh my god. Hammer. Other side. Thank you. So many shades. You thought I was doing that throw sound effect? No, that's the literal game sound effect. Just... Fuck! Oh, I hit the guy behind him. 
Oh, you grow weaker. They drain you. Strength down to 16. There. A gargoyle! <laughs> Don't need that sound effect in my life. It was gargoyle, not margoyle. Margoyles are, are spiky. Protection from evil! The spiritual hammer should be able to damage it, because the spiritual hammer hammer is magical. And barring that, we switch to the flame blade. Get him? Get him? Get him? So loud in my ear. He's not dying. This doesn't seem to be working. Chat. <gasps> he died. Okay, just kidding. We got him. Woo! Thanks, B Cross, the two year resub. Also, shed the impure with the $5 GP toss. Listening to you play Dungeon Hack while I grind up a witch in Path of Exile. You've deafened me on more than one occasion, but your reactions are priceless. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, a, a fucking scroll of harm? I, uh, and what is this? A coin, a, another one of those coins. An apple. Ow. Stairs down! We did it! Going down. We're now on the fourth floor. <coughs> Sumitachi did it, everyone. There's gonna be gargoyles all over the fucking place. How many levels are in this? Ah! Sumitachi loses one level of experience in all his spells. Poopy just got them. Level drain, everyone. That's what level drain does. Back down to 7,000 experience points. All that progress, just... Ah, uh, Doc Martin, thanks for that resub. Is there restoration in this game? I don't know. I mean, if there was a spell of it, I can't cast it anymore anyway. Well, um... What's the plan here? We got to rest, restore all the spells anyway. Oh, man, that feels bad. Invisible to undead. Protection from evil. Detect magic. Cure light wounds twice. Maybe that's the play. If I make myself invisible to the undead dudes. Protection from evil. Spiritual hammer. Put on to shield. Sorry.
Invisible to undead. Poof. And now we go sneaky. They'll never know we're here. Shh, 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 Ooh, ooh. Uh, wand. Uh, a protection from electricity? Shh. Fuck. And of course, as soon as I attack, the invisibility goes away, so what's the point? Hammer! There it is, got him. Who opened that door? You did, monk. It's just all were rats on this level. Uh, okay. Punch in the meantime. Bonk. He dropped breezers! Ow. Okay, you know what? Step this way. So if I miss my hammer, it comes back faster. Fuck. Oh my god, this rare rat's beating my ass. Oh my god, die. Let's go ahead and use that cure critical right away. Thank you. Spiritual hammer plus one. Is that magic? Good, it is magical. Are you helpful? This is giving us one armor class. This one gives us... Not armor class. I guess we'll hold on to it just in case. I don't know if I want to walk in on this. Dad, is that you? Uh. <clears throat> <clears throat> Fuck. <clears throat> Did I get him? We actually got him. Holy shit. Double hit. I think it's a white. Uh, I forget which ones all have level drain. Uh, yay, a flower key. Mr. Plastic Roman, thanks to Twitch Prime resubby. Ah! <gasps> boots! I want them. Are they magic boots, please? Just regular ass Fucking boring ass dumb boots. <laughs> fuck! 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 <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> I think I got him. Victoria with a resub! They're just normal boots. <laughs> Okay, we got a bone key. Keep bashing their skull in. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> ha! Catch the hammer, throw the hammer. I think I killed him. What are you hiding? Jack shit, tight. There was someone there, where'd he go? Ah! 
Oh god, one shot him. Okay, good. Hello? Ah, fuck! <laughs> Fucking, this is getting to be left or dead now. No! It! Now we're down to level three? That's less than where we started! Fuck! I wanna get to level zero and die! Ugh. Drink this potion, nothing matters. You're invisible! We got a potion of invisibility. Perfect. Use it to our advantage. Go around all the monsters, we just find the exit. You don't see us. Don't see us. I think he sees us! Fuck! I panic through. Oh, fuck. Hammer! Oh, God. No! I ran the wrong way. Oops. Fuck, 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 fuck! No. Please die! Just keep throwing. Maybe we'll get our level back. No, sir. Please, no. Catch the hammer, throw it again. It, it expired. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. Acid! Or lightning bolt? We leveled up! <laughs> We're back up to level seven. Or level four. Got seven hit points. And apparently, this is a wand of lightning the whole time. And it's gone. Fuck. Uh, 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 fuck. <laughs> Urgh, fuck! Wait, what am I doing? You oh! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> no! No, come back! I need that! <laughs> Close it. No. Go ahead and get our spells. It's fine. It's fine, chat. It's fine. I'm doing great. Okay. Okay. Okay, that panic eat. I was trying to close the door. Uh, I'm gonna stick with this. Oh no, they're, they're gonna find me. They're gonna find me. They're looking through the doors. What direction was I even going? I like. That way, I think. I f An ion stone? Fuck me up! Yeah! What's it do? I can't tell what this ion stone does for me. But it's floating above my head. Ha! Got him. Door won't budge. I don't stun a double experience, would be nice. Sure would. <laughs> Demon oxide, thanks for that resub. 
They don't really use iron stones anymore, do they? Flower key? Are they in 5th edition? I've not looked at them like, at all then. Cabinets, gifting a sub to Matt does that. Oh, the double tap. Fucking dead end. God damn it. I do not have a scroll of level drain protection. A school of rocks is another $6.90. Because I'm still wasting Christmas bonus money to shout. Matt does that for his birthday being today, I guess. Oh, happy birthday, Matt does that. Some pro love loved him, Matt. For his birthday. Good adventures go left? Dude, where the fuck are the stairs? I want to leave this place. I feel like I've been running down here forever, and yet I've barely uncovered the map. Hey, hey, hey! Uh, Fucking god damn it, he got me again! Back down to level three, chat! Jaws of Fenrir also with the Twitch Prime sub. Oh, hey! A garnet! Or a dagger if you prefer. I'm hungry. Nom. Nom. God damn it. This is the worst. Okay. Hello? I want to be done forever, please. But, like, not dead. Ha! Fuck! Ha! Fuck! Hammer? Eh. Alright, back up to level four. But this time, you got nine hit points when you leveled up. So, really, just turn. it's better this way. The dead end the whole time. God damn it. We've lost so many experience points. Wait. I've, I've been here. This does nothing for me. This is not the direction I want to go. Where the fuck am I going? This door here? That's like the only option I got left at this point. The longer I stay here, the more dangerous it is. No, fuck. <clears throat> uh, we haven't used this door yet. Hello? Oh, uh, hey, friends. What do ion stones do for you? They float around your head, and they just give different bonuses. It's like having a magic ring, but. A uh, stone for your brain. Can't have the resub. After a year and a bit off, you might play finish Dragon Heist on Friday. Off to Avernus. That's awesome. Congrats. Uh, 
I don't understand. I guess all that's left here is this door? Ugh. Ow. <laughs> Fucking goddamn. No, don't diddle. Says there's treasure in here. That's oh, just the boots. Mm. Fuck. Mm. No. Mm. Uh. Throw, 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 throw. Uh. Is that a dog man or what? It's a were rat. Uh. Guy becomes a rat creature. Mm. Instead of something sexy like a wolf, it's just a rat. Uh. Fucking goddamn! Why there's so many? Saving throw succeeded. And the spiritual hammer's gone. The spiritual hammer's gone. I can bash you the mace. No. No. Ah. Help me, Stone. Ow. I'm a uh, uh, potion. Yay, it healed. Thank God. Uh. Got him. Basic answer to Switch Prime. Resub. Getting up to a silver shirt. Try to get some spells. Hold, hold, flame hammer. Uh, Q core detect, protection, bless. Thanks for the reason I got myself and my friends into D&D and magic. Hope you have a good do have a good one. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Hope you're doing well too. Bless. <laughs> Protection from evil. Spiritual hammer. Alright, jacked up and good to go. Hey! Got him. Okay. Alright, so one of the doors I have not been in is all the way at the start here. Which went to nothing! <clears throat> What the fuck did I miss, chat? I went through all the possible doors. There's gotta be something here. Like a extra button or something that makes a wall slide away. Was protection from evil doing this? Uh, against evil creatures, you get a, a plus two to your, <clears throat> was it saving throws and armor class? It shouldn't be an illusionary wall, because I kept illusionary walls turned off, because I didn't want to deal with that. I've done the dungeons where you have to, like, walk through every wall, because you just never know. Look at it this way, I've killed like <clears throat> everyone. <clears throat> Fuck. <clears throat> God damn it. <clears throat> hey guys! <clears throat> nothing! <clears throat> yeah! Open door. <clears throat> yeah! <clears throat> <clears throat> Please just let me go. <clears throat> Just give me the fuck out of here. Ow. Got so many silver coins. Don't diddles. Alright, Sumitachi's now level 5, getting 9 hit points. Think about level. Oh, what? What hit me? 
Oh no, we just lost it. Immediately lost it. As soon as we got it, it's gone. Just all of it's gone. All of it's gone. Ah. <laughs> and it's gone. Here you go. Was it good for you too? Oh, fucking God, please don't. Oh, there goes. Yep, there goes another level. And we're back down to level three. Please! I'm trapped! I'm trapped! Hammer! Sorry, I accidentally pressed the map button. Hammer throw! Negate plane protection? Is that good? Or negative plane protection? I actually... Ooh, another ion stone! Float above my head! Functionality-wise, I actually don't know what that does. Negative plane protection protects against level loss. Cool. I'm just gonna turn the corner and there's the exit. Wait, what the fuck was that thing? That's oh, on one of those guys. It's fine, we're almost out of here. Back to level four, gaining ten hit points this time. You know what? Ten hit points? Like, fuck if I'm losing that. Oh, there it goes. Only works once. It works once, then it's gone. But it worked. That's- seriously, it's not even aura, it just like, absorbs one drain. Found the steps! Fuck it, I'm out. <laughs> Cockatrice! Cockatrice! Okay. Cure, cure. Detect protection. Ah, uh, bless. Flame bait. Hold person, hold person. Spiritual hammer. Still no level three spells. Detect magic. It's a good ring. Spiritual hammer. God, protection from evil. Let's see what this ring does for us. Bing! No idea, but it's good. And we're finding a billion more keys right away. Um, all right, we're gonna go, whoops, protection for petrification. Ah! There, well, it's draining our levels again. Just lost it all. It's all gone again. I hate this game. This is the worst D and D game. Never play this one. It sucks, chat. Daggeries. Ow. At 
least these monsters are worth like crazy amount of amounts of experience points. That is not a gelatinous cube, that's a teleporter. Hello? Hello! Oh god, yeah. We're level two now. We're now level two. But those things are both 1,200 experience points a pop, so... Oh, another teleporter. Cool. Level three. Gain eight hit points. Alright, where's this go? Fuck me up. Hi. Right. He dropped a coin and a potion of red. That's not magical? Oh, it's going to be glowing. That's a danger potion. We're not drinking this. Go on the teleporter. Flower key. Do I still have one? Nope. <laughs> Up. Yep. Level two. <laughs> this is this has been a bad day. Back up to level three now. Only seven hit points this time. You're right, maybe we should drink it. I feel really sick now. Is that what you wanted, chat? Happy? There's so many teleporters. Don't worry, the glowing green uh, is, a, is probably a good thing. Like, we can probably just sleep it off. <clears throat> Sumitachi suffers the ravages of poison. Oh, my God. hammer throw? There's so many teleporters. It's a crazy level. <clears throat> Fighting while sick. What a badass. Uh-oh. Oh, God. God. <sighs> Bing bong. Hello? Cool, man. Yep. Oh, we're level one. We are level one with zero experience points. We are level one with zero experience points. We kill them turn out 1,200. Being level one's pretty fun. Uh, did you see any experience points from walking forward? Inexplicably hit level two. <clears throat> ah. <laughs> now you're hop. Now my legend will truly begin. Oh. Have take all my money. Just whatever it'll take to save me. Just take all my money. Any of that work? Ah. <coughs> fuck, fuck. Well, let's see where this one goes. Oh. I found the flower key, the key of faith. <laughs> End me. A scroll of aid! Save me! These bonus hit points is like leveling up! There are 
like far less enemies in this floor compared to others. All right, back up to level three. Don't get too excited because it's just going to go away. Fuck me up. Do it. I dare you. End me. Dropped a rock. Not magical. Regular rock. Another ion stone. Boom. Still not sure what that does for me. But dude, he's got like three ion stones all floating around him. That's great. Oh, hey. And level drain and level drain level one again chat we oh fuck uh hold on we got rest <clears throat> our spiritual hammer ran out all right pray for spells that's it this is what we get <laughs> oh right he was poisoned <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> All right. Well, you know what? Check the scoreboard. DF still did the best thus far. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna lay down for a second. Blah. All right, I gotta end this recording for YouTube. If you're joining us over on YouTube, thanks. If you want to see more runs of just dungeon hack weirdness, let me know. Let me know in the comments. Otherwise, be sure to watch me live over at twitch.tv slash Thank you so much, YouTube. Really appreciate it.